Bismillahirrahmanirrahim. <coughs> Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh. And very good morning to all my beloved students. Okay, today we'll see about new topics for year four mathematics, unit three, which is a uh, money. Today we're going to learn about addition and subtraction of money. Hari ini kita nak belajar tentang penambahan dan penolakan wang. Actually, you have learned about addition and, and subtraction of money uh, since last year. Tahun lepas pun awak dah belajar dah tentang tambah dan tolak. Cuma nilai nilai wang tu semakin besar. Eh? Alright, you can refer to your textbook. Turn to page 105 ok, boleh tolongkan mungkin surat 105 ok, this is addition of money you can see example there boleh tengok contoh dekat situ ok next, we go to page uh, 108 this is subtraction of money eh, penolakan wang and got got a few example there ada beberapa contoh dekat situ next we go to addition and subtraction of money eh turn to page 110 alright okey tengok dekat situ eh addition and subtraction of money dekat situ ada beberapa contoh tentang penambahan dan penolakan wang so if you see example here this is example of mixed operation of money kalau awak tengok contoh soalan ni sebenarnya ini adalah contoh soalan operasi bergabung melibatkan wang eh, you have learned about mixed operation in unit 1 whole number awak dah belajar dalam unit 1 uh, nombor bulat tentang operasi bergabung eh operasi yang melibatkan lebih daripada soalan yang melibatkan lebih daripada satu operasi sebagai contoh kat sini kita tengok tambah dan tolak ok a few example here alright ok now <coughs> Okay, we'll try to do question number 3, eh? page 111. Okay, page 111, question number 3, 332 ringgit 60 sen plus 36,780 ringgit and 90 sen yeah. minus ok, got one box here this is unknown ini nilai kita tak tahu yeah, diwakilkan dalam kotak so equal to 18,570 ringgit and 45 sen. So how we are going to solve this kind of problem? Jadi macam mana kita nak selesaikan bentuk soalan yang sebegini? Alright. So first of all, we can change this number okay we got three number here one two and three into smaller value kita boleh tukarkan dulu nombor ni kepada nombor-nombor yang ada dalam soalan ni kepada nilai yang lebih kecil for example okay i change to okay four plus two minus unknown equal to five so 4 plus 2 we got 6 6 minus unknown we got 5 so 
unknown here equal to jadi macam mana kita nak cek nilai unknown kat sini jadi 6 tolak sa 1 so uh, sorry 6 tolak 5 6 minus 5 so we got 1 so here this is 1 jadi bila awak dah buat macam ni awak akan nampak konsep dia macam mana sekarang kita nak cek nilai unknown untuk nombor yang lebih besar macam ni melibatkan wang eh ok now let we solve this question jadi kita tambahkan dulu tadi ok 24,332 ringgit 60 sen plus 36,780 ringgit and 90 sen so we plus jadi kita tambahkan we add so 6 plus 9 we got 15 Okay, 1 plus 2, we got 3. 3 plus 8, we got 11. 1 plus 3, we got 4. 4 plus 7, we got 11. Again, 1 plus 5, we got 5. Oh, sorry, 1 plus 4, we got 5. 5 plus 6, uh, 5 plus 6, we got 11. Okay, again. 1 plus 2, we got 3. 3 plus 3, we got 6. Alright. So, next. Sixty-one thousand one hundred and thirteen ringgit fifty cent. We minus with eighteen ringgit. Uh, sorry, 18,570 ringgit and 45 sen. Okay. So, 0 cannot minus with 5. Okay. We take 1. So, here become 10. 10 minus 5, we got 5. 4 minus 4, we got 0. Okay. 3 minus 0, we got 3. So here 1 subtract by 7, we cannot perform. So we take 1 from here, this one become 0, this one become 11. 11 minus 7, we got 4. Here 0 again, we cannot subtract. So here become 10, 10 minus 5, we got 5. Again, 0. So, we take 1 from 6. This one, so 6 become 5. This 0 become 10. 10 minus 8, we got 2. 5 minus 1, we got 4. Okay. So, don't forget to put the decimal point here. So, now we got the final answer. 42,543 ringgit and 5 sen. Okay. So we back to the question. So just now we already add these two number, so we get sixty one thousand one hundred thirteen ringgit and fifty cent. Oh sorry, just now this is. 
stop question. So minus unknown equal to eighteen thousand five hundred seventy seventy ringgit and forty five cent. So unknown equal to So we so just now we already performed the subtraction sixty one thousand one hundred thirteen ringgit sorry sixty one thousand one hundred thirteen ringgit and fifty cent so we minus with so we subtract with eighteen thousand five hundred seventy ringgit and forty five cent so final answer we got forty two thousand five hundred 43 ringgit and 5 cent okay that's all for today i hope all of you you enjoy this subtopic okay see you again bye assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh